You are the head of a notorious disorganized crime family. What crimes are you committing? Trying to email scam members of the royal family of Nigeria. Unintentional tax fraud, because we messed up our income declaration. Assaulting batteries. We're breaking into your house and tangling the hangers in your closet and teaching you all well. Behave dog bad habits. Trafficking jam. Stealing cars in mall parking lots and just moving them to a random other spot in the same lot. We are robbing banks on the brink of bankruptcy. Identity theft while signing our own names. I don't know. You'll have to ask Vinny. Vinny will tell you to ask Charlie. Who'll tell you to ask me? We're not very organized. We're opening up boxes of meal replacement bars and individually reselling the bars that say, not labeled for individual resale. Moneying laundry. Using a vacuum cleaner to steal all of the world's air. We do up forgeries but none of us has any skills beyond stick figure drawings. Even our sculpture fakes look like stick figures. It's a protection racket. My guys go to local businesses and leave them envelopes of cash for the owner to use to be able to protect himself in case of emergency. Showing up to buildings that have already burned down saying, nice place you got here. Be a shame if anything happened to it. I would sneak into people's houses and put milk in their humidifiers. Ripping tags off mattresses. Aggressively jaywalking. We're cat burglars, and we steal cats. However, we're completely unable to fence them, since there's not much of a market for cats, and we keep getting scratched and bitten in the meantime. We break into your home while you're asleep and put your eyeglasses somewhere other than where you left them. We're standing on the grass. Reverse theft. We come up with our heists at the last second and then chronically show up late to the target. Breaking into offices and moving everything on the desk slightly to the left. I would ask 15 different goons to whack the same guy and they'd all forget to do it. Screw it. We are a disorganized crime family. We are going to the local orphanage and unalphabetizing the files. Stealing Ben Franklin's teeth from the Washington Monument. Liberating car batteries. We are contract garden gnome assassins and order pineapple on our pizzas. Torrenting. Breaking into schools to change the teacher's master key to all wrong answers. Tax fraud because I'm too dumb to do it correctly. Counterfeit pennies in Canada. Breaking into the Tower of London to steal the crown jewels while the next coronation is occurring. Nice try FBI. None. We keep forgetting where we put the guns. Stealing all the Legos to make a Lego super weapon. 
We have an aquarium in our brothel so our enemies can sleep with the fishes. Identity switcheroos. Just switching the identities of a bunch of random people but doing nothing with the info. Breaking into homes. Spreading Legos on the floor on the side of the bed and micro machines on the floor at the top of the stairs. Insider trading. Stealing underwear. Family of seven eating one pound of asparagus each and peeing on parked cars, doorsteps, and from overpasses. Insurrection S. Starting an underground marijuana trafficking ring starting in Colorado and California. We say, I don't know, can you, to the teacher. Selling music downloaded on Napster. Identity proof, we ain't telling nobody your name. I don't know, I have no idea what my underlings are doing or even who they are. Robbing banks, but we all are the getaway driver. Serving food to the hungry without a permit, including lemonade for the thirsty. Full crackhead god alchemist level war crimes including creating a taser bumper car and driving it in a school as one of the tamer ones on the record loitering in front of no loitering signs then slowly walking away when the sun goes down we really have no idea who's paying into our protection racket so tell ya what we'll just give ya the benefit of the doubt have a nice day and see ya next month. Discreetly walking through store aisles and pouring nair into the shampoo bottles. Become bounces at the local emergency room. We steal worthless items from the homes and properties of hoarders. Money dry cleaning. I don't have time to launder it. Stealing coins out of water fountains, one coin at a time. Breaking into people's houses for the sole purpose of petting their animals. Maybe give them a snack if we're feeling dangerous. We're breaking into people's homes and putting Kool-Aid powder into their shower heads so they get all sticky when they try to clean off and have nowhere to get unsticky. Breeding mules to smuggle drugs. Break into pizzerias and throw pineapple around. We have a protection racket where if stores don't pay up our goons unfold clothing and abandon products in locations they don't belong versus putting them back where they picked the item up. Probably real money laundering through cryptocurrency only to end up forgetting passwords. We are selling indigestion meds on the street. Out pizza in the hut and expecting the Spanish Inquisition. We steal catalytic converters off of Brinks trucks. Attempted coup, but like the silliest possible way by spinning up conspiracy theory types who think I won an election I clearly lost. Ignoring all traffic rules. NFS in real life. Various and sundry crimes with no consistency or plan. At customs we fail to declare our love for you. 
break into every house in a neighborhood except for one and leave a well-lubricated watermelon. Trying to break into Scrooge McDuck's money bin. Mostly jaywalking and loitering, but every now and then we spice it up with public indecency. Stealing fork knife games and replacing them with Minecraft. Then selling the fork knife stuff to use the money for buying shares of GameStop and AMC. My disorganized crime family films hobo fights, but Joe Shom keeps on tagging the locations and people while filming his Insta stories. Damn it, Joe Shmo. Going into laundromats and taking one sock from each dryer. My family and I run a pool cleaning service as a front. Clients who don't pay us get 50 liters of paint in their pools. Pretty much anything that starts with Florida man. Selling nonsense of Japanese porn. We're supposed to be trafficking drugs. But our shipments keep going to the wrong address. I know I have that invoice here somewhere. Is the Patriarch's name Donald? S. Don't forget to share, like and subscribe for more content.